three to go. And this is three. Chelsea away, followed by Everton away, followed by the Champions League final against Napoli. That's the first team. Kane and Ramos are fit. Traore's fit. Midfield's fit. Bembe's fit. Wan-Bissaka's fit. Everyone besides Saliba. Well, we'll bring Van Dijk in and Kone are fit. You see, now I've got a couple of days before Everton. And then Everton, then Everton I've got a full week's rest before the Champions League final. So I just may as well play the strongest team possible. Let's do it. Stamford Bridge. Let's win the game on a high. Let's win the season. Let's finish the f career mode. Not just the season, but the career mode on a high. Let's win these final two Premier League games. Let's not have a repeat of what happened at Palace. Let's have more goals, more entertainment like we did at Anfield. Dupembe does well. And the referee doesn't do well. And that's really good from Sanderberger. And that's really shit from Wan Bissaka. Berger. Trail ready. <laughs> Certainly thought that well. Ow. Bloody kit. I kept catching my foot on something. My lad, who sits in my chair, even though I tell him not to, has dropped a Pringle. And I've now scratched my toe on a Pringle. Great. Presnell. Oh, hello. Virgil. If you can't, if you can get past one, nine times out of ten, you can't get past the other. There we are. There's a gap for Ramos. Really well saved from Musso. Now I know that Pringle's there, I'll be honest, the rest of this video has got to be quite hard, because I want to I want to fucking get rid of that Pringle. <laughs> anyway. Presnell knocks it back. Ah. Right. Bin. Sorry, but this is bugging me. Fucking kids, who'd have them? I've got two. And for why, honestly, sometimes I don't quite know. Wait. Don't take that corner just yet. Excuse me, but this is why I like to do unfiltered YouTube. You don't see a bloke cleaning up Pringles halfway through a career mode video on any other YouTube channel and if you do please let me know and I will subscribe because that's the short court short of shit we love corner taken short Yangel Herrera blocks it straight out for another corner Havertz again short to Pulisic and again it's pretty shit Kim Pembe Traore it's Kane it's a great ball Ramos. Aye! That's twice I've done that in the past couple of episodes. Took that touch, thinking I can get round the man, and I can't. That's how easy it is for this team now, though. That through ball from Kane. Ramos makes that run. We're so lethal. It's such a fucking deadly team that we've created. Kane. You can see what I'm trying to do there. Very good idea. Not quite executed. Havertz. Let's see what he's tried to do there, and it is executed perfectly. As is Pulisic. Not quite that time. 
Gallagher, immense. Ramos into Keane, and that's where you want that to be the other way around. That bit of pace that Ramos has that Kane doesn't. And that slightly bit of technical ability that Kane has that Ramos doesn't. Berger that does have insane technical ability. Juan Bissaka's ball into Traore. Balls to Sander. Berger! I'm Berger! And João Ramos strikes it into the net 1 0 after 40 minutes. We haven't heard me shout hamburger in a while, to be honest. It's like I've grown up, but I'm not. That touch there is really good. Struck it well. It's off the post. Falls back to Jao Ramos, who's chasing Harry Kane. That's why I want to play Kane and Ramos in these final two league games. I want them to come with the 1 2 in the Golden Boot race. I want one or the other to win, and I want the other one to come second. But great strike from Sander Berger. That's 20 for the season now. For Jao Ramos. But yeah. Um, great strike from Berger. That really was a lovely, well hit strike. It's a shame that didn't go in, to be honest. We, we prefer the goals like that to go in. But Jao Ramos showing why he's got so many goals this season. He is always there or thereabouts. Corne does well. Burger. 1 0 up. Can't ask for more than that, can we? Um, team's been okay. It's been a bit more sloppy than it has been against Liverpool and. Man United the past few games, but we've been more tight at the back today, I believe, than in those other two games. Hence why we've scored less, but also conceded less. Gallagher. Creates half a yard, puts in a great ball. It's Kane. It's a fantastic save. Really is. Kane hoping to pull a little bit further away again in the Golden Boot race. Gets in front of Domingos. Just gets his right foot on it. Just hits him, really lands on him and then it just goes a bit too close to the keeper Gallagher shit look that teed up lovely and when they go in they are orgasmic that wasn't but we try for it I like screamers on Kingroom games that's what we try and score we try and score the good goals Sometimes, if we're in a bad run of form or whatever, we'll just go for any goal. I don't care, but usually I'm a fan of a, of a sexy goal. I'm also the fan of a crunching tackle. Oh, that's a fucking crunching tackle. And yet again, it's Presnel Kimpembe giving away a penalty like it was last episode. And again, it's just a slight touch from Pulisic just before... Right, so he went that he went to my left, so I'm going to my right. Oh yes. Last episode they went one way, so today I thought fuck it, I'm going the other. And it was the right call. Virgil's all day against Pulisic. Two poor penalty giveaways from Presno King Pembe. Oh have a junior trailer, that's effortless. Keane. Ramos offside, that's not who I wanted it to in the first place, but it was deflected into him. The original pass was going where I wanted it to, just good defending. Great ball, great touch from Silas. Fresh legs as well, he's only just come on. Corne, can he handle it? Oh, he's got the ball in, but Kid Pembe, he's got it out. He's done well there, Kid Pembe. Virgil. Having none of that. Corne, Virgil, Gallagher, Berger, Ramos, Kane, half a yard, Kane. Ramos made a good run there, to be fair, probably should have played it into him. Kim Pembe gives away the penalty at one end, puts a header in at the other. 
Poisson bailed him out the shit, but then he made the goal for himself. He is definitely forgiven now. Although I think I heard the commentator say own goal. So Preston will keep a good header. Oh, and it hits the man on the line. Was it going in? I don't know, actually. Either way, Ben Chilwell, own goal, 2-0. There's a great goal in Tabard Junior Trail where he's got half a yard. That's really poor given the amount of room and time he had there. And there was no no other option for me there but to shoot. That's not one of them ridiculous things. Why did you shoot from there? I think most people would. Some might have took an extra touch, but like I said. We like the screamers here, and to be fair, I do get quite a lot of them. Some people might not like that about me, but for me, I just love a screamer. I can't do skill at all, so there's no point in trying to do skill move goals. Berger, again. Berger. It was stretching away, so I had to. I just hit it and hoped. To be fair, it wasn't a bad shot. It was always curling away, though. Oh well. Here's the young goal scorer. Thank you very much. It's a fantastic ball to Kai Havertz. Is he onside? He is. Is that a fantastic move? Yes, it is. Silas. Pembe. Silas. Save. He's offside. Great save from Poisson. He wasn't to know. Fuck it, we'll get some time wasting subs on. And when the ball next was out of play, we'll bring on Brewster. Bring on Reiki on. And bring on Saliba. Fresh legs at the back. Keep that clean sheet. Corney. Herrera. Herrera. Pull back to Corney. Gallagher. Juan Bissaka. Buries it. And calls this quits. In the 85th minute. There we are. Aaron Juan Bissaka. Lovely goal. Great ball across. Then Corney. Gallagher. Juan Bissaka. Strike. 3 0. And we are finishing off this season in style, as I would have hoped and expected us to. We had a couple of dodgy results here and there this season, to be honest with you. Like I've said as well this season, if this was real life, we wouldn't be winning the league. Man City be beat us to the league. We've lost a fair few games this season in this career mode. If this is IRL, we don't win this league. Fortunately, most of the other teams in the Premier League have been dropping points as well. And quite a lot. Usually you need 90 odd points to win the Premier League. This season we're only going to get a like high 80, but still fucking impressive. That we'll, we would win it most seasons in the noughties and the 90s. And to be fair, the beginning, early early 10s, like up until 2014, 15. But until Guardiola come along, Brewster, he's on side. Went to chip in, went for the extra. I was going to try and skill past him, but I knew it would work, so I thought, fuck it, just chip it instead. Then hit that, and just over from Brewster. Could have been four, but... Alas, just the three. And that's where it finishes. Chelsea nil, Sheffield United three. What a way we are ending this season couple of great goals. Jao Ramos is here. That touch there from Berger. Left foot struck well. And Ramos onside. Great goal. This here, great cross from Traore. Great header from Kipembe. Was it going in? I don't know. Did they keep it a touch? It doesn't know because it just shows you Ben Chilwell. Let's watch this again. I don't want to see that. Can he 
a lot of work with that two, I think. I think he does. This angle will show it best. Oh, fuck off. Forget it. Forget it, EA. Your game's shit. Anyway, we battered them. Thoroughly, did they? had all the possession. And there's another 4 2. That time, Man United on the right side of it, though. The final Premier League game of the career mode. We have got Everton at Goodison. And as you can see here, like I was saying, if we win this game, we're only on 86. We will have lost six games through five. If you do that in the Premier League currently, you come in third behind Liverpool and Man City. It's amazing. But fortunately, you see Liverpool and Man City well off it. Only getting mid to high 60s. 30 points off the pace they usually are. What meant? We can come in and win that Premier League title. Um, the penultimate episode ever of this career mode. Coming up next episode, the final ever Premier League game. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you so much. Like, subscribe. Take care. Bye-bye.